Let's start. Today we will see how to implement the multi-timeframe intraday intensity index indicator in the TradingView Pine script. The intraday intensity index is a volume-based technical indicator that integrates volume with a securities price. Traders can use the intraday intensity index to follow how intraday highs and lows are moving with volume in comparison to the previous day's closing price. Let's see the code. This is an indicator function with a name, multi-timeframe intraday intensity index. First, we take the user input for the higher time frame. The default value is set to 30 minutes. Here we use the triple I function to calculate the intraday intensity index. Then we use the security function to calculate the higher time frame intraday intensity index. The first argument of the function is the current stock name. The second argument is the higher time frame. The third argument is the intraday intensity index. Bracket 1 written in front of the index avoids the indicator repainting. The fourth and fifth arguments handle the gaps and the bar merge. Then we calculate the color of the index. If the index is above zero, we color it green, otherwise, we color it red. Finally, we plot the index, along with a zero line for reference. Let's add this indicator to the chart. As you can see, the intraday intensity index has been added to the chart. When the index is above zero and green in color, it means the intraday movement is bullish in nature. When the index is below zero and red in color, it means the intraday movement is bearish in nature. Right now we are seeing the 30 minutes intraday intensity index on the 1 minutes chart. Let's change the time frame to 5 minutes. Right now we are seeing the 5 minutes intraday intensity index on the 1 minutes chart. So that's it. That's how you can implement the multi time frame intraday intensity index in the TradingView Pine script. Thank you.